So a few years ago, we met a then 55-year-old man named Jeffrey, who had recently found out that his 25-year-old girlfriend, Erica, had cheated on him with a man named Cortez. Not only that, there was a chance that Cortez could be the father of Jeffrey's son, who was named Jeffrey Jr. So take a look at how this outrageous story played out. I know that I lied to Jeffrey, and I know that I cheated on him, but all my secrets are now out. I pray that Jeffrey Sears is Jeffrey Jr.'s father, but I fear that Cortez is the real dad. You would prefer that your yes. fiance Jeffrey be the father? Yes. Because he would be in his life. Yes, he's been there for him the, my whole pregnancy. But you and Cortez wasn't a committed relationship. It was not a committed relationship. We just off and on. You had a committed relationship with Jeffrey. Correct. Except your definition of commitment is a little different because you were still seeing Cortez. Yes, I was. There's only one person to blame about this. <laughs> I, know it's, I know it's all my fault. <laughs> I think that Eric is doing this for one reason and one reason only. What is it? He's still in love with me. You think that little boy could be yours? I mean, it's a possibility. You believe that multiple men could be the father of hey, Jeffrey Jr. Possibility. Oh, possibility. we'll see, because y'all the only two fathers. We're going to see Dato. How about that little one? How about Jeffrey Jr.? This is my son, man. Was this a surprise to you of when, when Cortez comes into all this? It's hard to hold my composter right now because he looks like Tez. This last time he was with him. This morning, before we came. In the case of two-year-old Jeffrey Jr., Jeffrey, you are not the father. <laughs> Cortez, you are the father. I told you! I told you! I love you with every ounce of my soul, but you love him so much, you go be with him, because you out. Well, Jeffrey was blown away by those revelations, but guess what? Throughout it all, Jeffrey and Erica stayed together, and today they are back. Sadly, it's not a happy update, because about a year ago, Erica gave birth to their youngest son, Javier. Shortly after that, Jeffrey caught Erica in bed with her former boss, leading him to believe that Javier is not his child. First of all, Jeffrey, you think the fact that you all are 31 years apart, do you think that causes a lot of these issues? I want to say yes, but the truth of the matter is I am older, I am wiser, and I just don't do dumb stuff no more. So you went back so. home, and you all stayed together, didn't you? Yes. Even though you knew that you weren't the father of Jeffrey Jr., you raised him as your own. Yes, sir. And, and I get the feeling, did you forgive Erica? No, I just forgot. Now we're talking about not only Javier, you now have doubts about your daughter, Jaslyn. Is that correct? Why? If you cheat once, it, as my daughter says, it's a mistake. <laughs> but if you cheat two, three, four, five times, that's a habit. I didn't cheat on you around the time I got pregnant with Jaslyn. What was your reaction to Erica's pregnancy with Javier? Were you happy? I was happy because it was another son, but this one, in my mind, as I thought, Junior, I'm thinking that he is my son. This is why I'm here now, to make sure he is my son. Then, of course, you find these suspicious text messages in Erica's phone. Yes, sir. Yeah. Too much to explain. I saw her in the sexy outfit I bought for her. I thought it was me. I walked past her phone, and I picked it up. Some take me to stop. I picked it up, and it was me. How did you find out about her and her former boss? He was my boss. I got her the job. <laughs> and I went to the job to pick her up, and uh, something seemed funny. I went there early. I wasn't thinking of anything at the time, but as I got there, again, it was his birthday. I didn't know that. I found that out afterwards. She came out of the job. I opened the door for her to get in my van. I was telling him, <laughs> it's funny, I was telling him, later on, bro. And she went and got in his vehicle. And I was like, what is going on? And even though I could see with my eyes, my heart, just wouldn't let me believe it. But I, 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 let him, I let her go. Yeah, but later on, what did you find? After I went home and brewed on it and, and kept trying to convince myself, no, nah, it ain't what's happening, the devil in me said, get up. And I went to the house. Uh, I had the key in my pocket. I was so mad, I didn't realize I had the key in my pocket. Snuck through the window and cried the whole time. I seen him in the bed, and I... Again, I, I wasn't me. I made a mistake. That's more than one mistake. That's a hard mistake. This all happened after Javier was born, right? Yes, sir. You took that incident 
and said, well, if she's messing with him now, maybe she was messing with him before, right? At least that's what the devil in me told me. <laughs> right. Nothing nobody else could have said would have made a difference. Why do you forgive me then? Why do you stay with me then if you feel that way? Well, be honest about it. You're a good Because you can't move on if you're still you, stuck you, on the past. How can you, we move forward you, if you're going to keep throwing past in my face? Well, I got a past too. But my Absolutely. past doesn't my past doesn't affect you. I pay the bills, I take care of you, I take care of my kids. If that's not good enough, why are you here? Let me take a look at these two kids. You see some similarities? In my heart, yes. But in my mind, hell to the no. He made a pretty strong statement. You say you love him, and he questions whether you really do because you've cheated, like, more than once. OK, this is my thing, Mark. I know that I cheated. I know I made a very bad mistake. And once again, More I'm than sorry. once. But you imagine trying to move forward with somebody that still says they love you and they claim they forgive you. It's like every time I do something, it's like it's a I don't forgive you. If, if I, I say I would, you. If I say I'm going with my mom or I'm doing something, something, okay, it's a guy going to be or you're just going to cheat. So you imagine when you feel like you're trying and you feel like you're getting somewhere and he's constantly telling me I'm cheating. I'm cheating. That makes me want to go do it. You can understand his doubts, can't you? I definitely do. I, def I understand his doubts with Javer, but not with Jazz. She's three years old. If that was the case last time he was on this show, he could have got a test then. I'll answer that. But look at all the things you've done, see, and I had no control over it then or now. Right now, I'm here because I need to be, because I want to make sure that I can still be the best daddy in the world to the kids. And just to let you know, it ain't going to make a difference whether they're my kids or not. I'm going to take care of them kids because that's what I'm supposed to do. Think about it. He found out that a boy named after him is not I his son that. and not his son. And, I get that. And he's his father, isn't he? Mm hmm. I but, get that. Javier should, should be Junior and Junior should be Javier. And he's the father figure in his life. And, and I appreciate that. He's been wonderful. He's been great. He could have moved out. Well, he sort of did. He went home. Erica, do you think, you think the uh, age uh, difference? Uh, okay, is... but, 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 listen, but listen to this. Here's my thing I'm 57, you're 26, and I know there's a big difference, but I got. You know, all these women, old girlfriends, they don't knock at my door. I don't call them. They don't call me. You know, so therefore, they're not in my life. What I'm seeing it from you is someone you went to job court with. Uh, but even if you went to job court with them, what that got to do with you being in the bed? When I got you a job, I expect you to do what you're supposed to do. How is sleeping with my boss or your boss supposed to change it? And then how did I catch it? And then when, you, when I did catch it, you told me this is what you said at the car. As I'm standing outside waiting for your job, she looked at me and said, we don't go together. Oh, man, I don't so, even know how I was even briefing. But before you even caught me with him, you was already denying Jaber. So it wasn't going to make it no better, right? Doubts Erica, are different Erica, than doing it. Do you have doubt as to whether Jeffrey's the father of Jaslyn and Javier? Oh, it looks like he's the one with all the doubt, because I said I'm 115% I'm sure. By the way, do you see a future with Jeffrey? Yes, I do. I hope that when he gets his answers for his two kids today, that we can continue to move forward. But if I got to keep hearing about what I'm doing or what I did five years ago or some things I did before I met him, no, it's absolutely not going to work. Well, then you better pack your bags. Either you're going to be a good queen for me and to me and my kids, or your ass is out. And I will not allow myself to keep being controlled or hearing things about my past, because everybody in the world has a past and done some things they were not supposed to do. But I bet they're not being judged. They don't live now. with me. I don't pay their rent. And that's fine. And they don't have but sex we're, with we're me. Gonna, we're so going to get your answers in just a minute. So we have the results right here. In the case of three-year-old Jaslyn, Jeffrey, you are the father. <laughs> in the case of one-year-old Javier, Jeffrey, you are the father. Okay. You. I, mean, I told you. <laughs> well, but listen, you told me Junior was my son, but he ain't. So okay, okay. I, I'm still happy. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, Jeffrey. Yes. yes. Put the yes. past in the past. He's your son. Now you've got another son and a daughter, okay? We're cool with that? Yes, I'm, I am trusting the two of you that I don't see you again. <laughs> and all I, do, all I do will get pictures of those beautiful kids, all right? You are not the father. <laughs>